Hello and welcome back to the channel. It's your boy Blackamora and today we're kicking off the Dragon Ball board game series. Is Dragon Ball Z Budokai 2 as great as I remember it or am I blinded by nostalgia? Let's get into it and find out. So one thing you need to know is that I love the soundtrack for this game. The entire Budokai series, to be honest, while it's not original, the soundtrack is banging. And uh, I'm sure you're going to agree with me the more that we play. So this was really an idea that I had because I wanted to play the games that I enjoyed growing up and find out whether I whether those are objectively good games or whether I was just blinded by the IP and the cover art. We're going to kick this off with Dragon Ball Z Budokai 2 because hopefully this series should kick off before Sparking Zero but if it doesn't... You know, here's another Dragon Ball game to get you excited for the latest and greatest what a banger soundtrack. Long ago, seven Dragon Balls were forged, which when gathered together would summon the Eternal Dragon to grant a single wish. The quest for these magic orbs is a perilous one, one that Goku has faced all too often. For over time, the allure of the Dragon Balls has attracted a host of powerful villains. In order to protect the Earth and to prevent the Dragon Balls from falling into evil hands, Goku has thrown himself into battle. So that little icon, that Goku flying on the Nimbus, that's going to be your main character. And as and always, he is fueled by a single burning desire to be the best. You can tell it's been 20 years. <laughs> Alright, level 1, let's go. So this is a unique way to tell the story of Dragon Ball. I really appreciate it. So, this is the planet where Kakarot is supposed to be. Yeah, and those Dragon Ball things have to be on this planet as well. First, how about we exterminate the people on this planet with the Cybermen? Ha ha ha, this soil should grow some fine Cybermen. Reddits, you hunt for Kakarot. I'll search for the Dragon Balls and deliver them to Master Frieza. Fine, it's done. Get the Dragon Balls before Nappa. Let's go. Okay. So, just like a dr <laughs> just like in a board game, you can pick your ally and you can have Kid Trunks fighting against Uncle Nappa. Well, I'm gonna go Cannon in this playthrough. I'm gonna pick Piccolo to be my partner. Because depending on who you pick, they have dialogue options with the enemies. So the first thing I'm gonna do is get that radar. And I believe there are about nine levels. It gets really hard towards the end when Boo starts entering the picture and stuff. There's the ball. It's the five star ball. Uh, Piccolo is going to go on the attack. I can't really remember how to play this game, but hopefully. Um, muscle memory kicks in. So, Nappa is going to go for the Dragon Ball, so we need to chase him, whereas Radix is going to come to us. And you're about to see what happens when enemies face. Talk for real? I have missed the voice acting. Yeah. Defeat the enemy, simple enough. Dragon throw, come on my heart. Alright, cool. I do have the Kaioken. Or the King Kai Fist as they've as they've put it. I, I would rather they put King Kai Fist than say KO Ken. Alright. And one thing I remember the loading screens in this time have mini games. Look how I'm making Master Roshi fly. That's probably not great audio. <laughs> but uh, I can't remember how many Cybermen I have to fight. Three? 
Let's not get embarrassed, huh? That's the main thing. Oh my god. <laughs> Get booted! Okay, here's your brother, huh? I'm watching out for that acid attack. I don't know if that's a Budokai 3 thing, but... Boom, get out of here. No match for the Kaioken. So, easy enough, Cyberman down. What have I got? Vaccine. Okay, that's gonna come in handy later on when a certain you know who gets a heart disease. Hey yo, these men are just literally planting them. All right, let's have Piccolo face Nappa. Surely they're gonna have some dialogue. You're a Namekian, huh? Disgusting insect. Unless you'd rather die, stand aside right now. Insect, huh? Well, be careful because this insect bites hard. Hey, yo, Piccolo. <laughs> hey, yo. <laughs> what was this? What was that? All right, destructive rave and demon roundhouse. Okay, so we got the bare minimum um, uh, move set right now. Hopefully, over the course of this playthrough, we'll unlock really cool moves like Spirit Bomb and Special Beam Cannon. Oh, why is Piccolo talking about biting hard? Dude. It's meant to be for kids. So, obviously, in the anime, well, in the original story, um, Raditz comes alone. And R Nappa and Vegeta come together. Oh! Oh, that's a mad thing. Hey, yo. I love this game. Oh! There's no teleport in this game, so if you get caught lacking, that's your ass. Die. Yo! <laughs> okay, I thought X down down was taunt, but it's not. Okay, Nappa down. I, well, it seems like I'm remembering how this game plays. Oh, these two are gonna have a chat, obviously. You're not Kakarot! Who are you? And what business do you have with me? Yeah, so as I was going to say, obviously Nappa and Vegeta were the pair that came to Earth after Raditz came by himself. But as you can see in this um, story mode, they kind of messed with the, the canon storytelling just to make it a bit more fun um, and a bit more sensible in terms of like a board game storytelling logic mechanic and I appreciate that look we all know the story of Dragon Ball we don't need it again I think there was some real fatigue um, when it came to like games like Rage and Blast and Burst Limit oh hey yo luckily you got hit with that um, spinning back heel kick I'm gonna send you to where your friend is. Get back, get bullied. Look, this might be cheap, but I'm trying to win, all right? I'm not trying to embarrass myself. I'm glad you got up. Stay dead. Okay, so far, easy peasy. Oh, you want some more? Goku ain't even gonna have to get his feet off the desk. I will be your opponent. 
I guess they ran out of things to say. I do remember there are certain characters that will have a conversation twice and even three times. I think Vegeta and 18 do maybe. Um, off the top of my head. But yeah, often it will just be one when it's like the side characters. And if it's someone that in canon they had no interaction, like Kid Trunks and Nappa, it, there would be no dialogue. So I'd always try to pick the characters that, that had the most dialogue so I could just hear the, the voice actors as represented in the show. Damn! Hey! Oh, I can hit him on the ground? Hey. I remember thinking this game looks so good. Come on, fly. Fly for me. So, oh no! <laughs> hey, yo, you know what they say, revenge is a fair play. Well, turnabout's fair play, I should say. He might have my number. Bye. Psych. I really hope you can hear me over the game, otherwise. <laughs> oh, Nappa. Okay, so I want Goku to have some fun now, so we're gonna do switcheroo. Hey, morale support, bro. Alright, Piccolo, get out of there. Come on. Yes. You're Kakarot, aren't you? What have you guys come to this planet for? What are we here for? We came for the things you call Dragon Balls. After we kill everyone on this planet, that is. Lend us a hat, would you, Kakarot? What are you going to use the Dragon Balls for? That does not matter. Come with us and join Master Frieza. So this Frieza guy's your boss, huh? I would never join anyone like that. And what's more, my name is Goku. So yeah, you can tell they've tried to be as close to the original script as possible. Ooh. Oh no. I was very confused when Raditz named his moves after the days of the week. Damn. Oh, he's strong. Yeah, get out. Oh. Oh my god. Oh lord, I thought I was being clever. So I think back here, you couldn't um, launch multiple key blasts, you could only do one at a time. Hey! Oh lord! Shit. <laughs> Let's go, the tight winds always feel the best. Bye Raditz. Nappa, do you want some? All right, let's go. You guys get off of Earth right now. Otherwise, you'll answer to me. You're Kakarot, huh? How about we see what you're made of? Do you really think that someone like you could beat me? There's no way you can beat me. You must be a comedian. Come on, fight! Fight we will. Fight we shall. And I'll even show you my Kaioken technique. I'm trying not to use it against Raditz because I don't need to, he's a scrub. But Nappa's a bit tough. I think his power level is like 5,000. Ooh. 
gordo. Damn. Get out of here with your crappy armor, you bum. Alright, I think I will kill Reddits first. But first, Piccolo, I want you to have some green on green violence. Lousy small fry. Some of these lines are very cheesy and I appreciate that. Alright, looks like this level is almost done. I can't even lie to you. Alright, I will not get into a full sense of security because I know once we get into like Cell and Super Boo especially, Kid Boo is the worst. But I'll be alright as long as I remember how to block. <laughs> Man's coming up on my... Yeah, man, allow it. Get out of it. Wait, that's not what I wanted to do. Bye-bye. Perfect. Let's go. <laughs> Keep your asset to yourself. I didn't mean to do it to him. I didn't mean it. Hey! You took my perfect from me! How dare! We don't need any more vaccines. We got enough. Alright, we don't have to worry about that one. Alright. Goku, I need you to commit. What's brother side? Bye, Raditz. You're not getting away, Kakarot! You again? This time, I won't hold back! Impossible! His battle power is rising so fast! I feel like if I was to use the Kaioken, he'd die. Near instantly. Say your prayers. Hey, yo, what? Mm. Oh. It's a fitting way for him to go. I wonder if I can knock him somewhere else. Let's go. And Goku didn't even need to die this time. I was hoping to unlock Raditz, I can't lie. Wait, I have Raditz already, don't I? Cool. Super Dragon Fist. Let's go. Dynamite Monday. Alright, cool. How do I add moves on? Or do moves just get added to me? How does this work? Alright, so I'm pretty sure Dende gives us an extra life, which is necessary. So Piccolo, you're going to get an extra life. And I'm certain that Nappa's going to come for us anyway, so I might show off a mechanic. If you press X to select your character, I think Square digs where you are standing. I'm just going to wait for it to show up underneath because one of the buttons cancels your move. <laughs> I don't want that. Circle is no action. Yeah. Nope. No thank you. What's the point? Squares dig, right? There you go.
So we got something. Let's go. Ah, damn. <laughs> it's not great. But it's good to show for the, the mechanic. There's no way that you can stand up to me, the mighty Nappa! Well, I guess you're pretty tough. It doesn't look like I can take you like this. Kaioken. So in some of the later levels, the Dragon Balls are hidden underneath the level. So you use the radar that we've picked up to find out where the Dragon Balls are. If you get all seven, I think you can wish for breakthroughs and an extra mode. Not entirely sure. So where's the Super Dragon Fist? Where am I meant to... I'm not sure where I'm meant to add that on. That's kind of weird. Oh well, let's kill Nappa. With you guys dead, there'll be no one else in our way. We can get the Dragon Balls ourselves. Alright, I am concentrating. Not that I need to. Ooh! <laughs> that was close. <laughs> okay, so Budokai 2 is the rougher game. Budokai 3 is a lot more smooth. This is still much more fun than Budokai 1. So I need to know where to equip those. So yeah, this is it. The enemies are dead. No, that's not it, is it? Um... Is it circle? Bear with. Set up skills. Oh, it's R1. Sweet. Thank you. I mean, we don't need the vaccine. But I know you've got some moves for me. So how do I do this one? Punch, forward, punch, punch. Okay. And this one is... Forward, kick, kick, kick. Alright, I'll try to remember that. That's tough, though. Cool. Piccolo. Fight that Cyberman. To be honest, I could go around the entire map and pick up everything. But that's not threading content. There's a really good YouTuber with a Budokai 1 playthrough. I recommend you check him out. Um... I'll put a link to his work in the comments. So if you were in fact curious if I was going to do a Budokai 1 playthrough, I'm not. <laughs> Ooh. Lucky. Oh, damn. I didn't realize I was beating his ass so hard. Second burst, same as the first. Ah oh, man, I hate that. Damn, I'm too good at this. Oh, super holy water. Oh, even the Cybermen are stopping to reproduce, so I'm just going to have a look at the map. How do I do that? Well, it doesn't matter. Let's finish this. Because I think we can get a couple of levels in, in an hour. You really are a strange one, huh? I like to think of Goku as a mix between Homer Simpson and Superman. Alright, well, we'll try one of these new moves. Zanku Fist. We're gonna, that's the aim. We're, we're aiming to get that done. So that's punch, forward punch, punch, and then energy blast. This is why I like this game, because it's closer to those games of, like, you have to string moves and press certain buttons, not just mash. There we go. 
and then I press a button. If we match, yep. If we match, he he, he dodges. If we don't match, then um, I get an extra hit. <laughs> I hope you're getting used to this music because you're not going to hear it much after this. Oh no, misjudged the distance there. Die. Oh no. Okay, that was overkill. But, you know, I didn't even go down to yellow, so I, you can tell how much more comfortable I am with this game. Oh, cool. <laughs> I think that just spoiled that Supreme Kai is playable. <laughs> Now I wonder if I pick Piccolo again for the next level, whether you have two lives or three. Oh, that's cool. I like that. Alright, let's get rid of this last Cyberman. Yeah, he's not even going to waste any more words on you. You just get a text. You're no match for me. Okay, so this time we're gonna look to get the Super Dragon Fist done. So that's forward kick, 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 energy. Do not watch the initials. That's the one good thing about the PS2 loading times being so long. You can actually get involved with these mini games. Oh, <laughs> I like this. I'm going to be using this a lot. Hey. Who told you you can attack? It's my turn. Yep. Damn. It will take hours for this face to be repaired after that acid attack. I'm not sure if this is true, but I'm pretty sure. <laughs> Damn. I'm pretty sure in uh, Budokai 1, you couldn't just press forward and circle to do the Kamehameha. You had to actually press square, 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 circle. So um, I hated that. So I'm very glad of this change. Don't need that. Yeah, there's no enemies to make their move. Um, let's have Piccolo dig. There's something. Hey, get some money. A hundred? You just left a hundred on the ground. You know what? We've got... A oh, crap. Is there a limit? Is there a turn limit? I actually can't remember. I'm sure it should be fine. Yeah, let's just get the Dragon Ball. We did it! Alright! I got the Dragon Ball! Time to go looking for the next one! Hey, hey! If you are enjoying what you're watching right now, please give us a thumbs up. Leave a comment, um, letting us know what other classic game you'd like for us to play. Oh, snowy mountains! It looks like Nappa and Raditz have been done in. I guess it's up to us, the Ginyu Force, to take care of this once and for all. Defeat Frieza. Okay, so obviously in the anime this happens on Namek. They've come to Earth because news of Raditz and Nappa being killed has made it throughout space and time. So who would have been around at this point? Krillin? Yeah, he would have been around. Let's go with Krillin. So I have to get the radar each level. That's annoying. I can't have Raccoon get that radar before me. No, thank you. 
So there's certain spots where there are certain um, gimmicks to the fights. As you can see below, if I was to go down here, there's a half-filled heart. And I think that means our health will continue to drop throughout our fights. I don't want that. So what I'm going to do is, I'm going to dig. And you can see the Dragon Ball on the radar, so maybe it is down there. Maybe I made a mistake. Where's Raccoon going? Uh-oh. We know what happened in the show. Krillin got bodied by Raccoon. <laughs> I may not live. <laughs> Have some, have some confidence, bro. I could have had Piccolo on the lineup. I chose you, bro. Don't let me down, please. This is not the time for doubting oneself, you know? This is life or death. You might be bigger than you, stronger than you, tougher than you. Like we have more money than you. But you can do this. Oh my god, this song. What a banger. So, I'll tell you how obsessed I was with Dragon Ball. When it snows, this song plays in my head. Damn, Raccoon. Hey, give me a challenge, yo. Oh no! You know why? It's because Critten's so small. When I punch, I'm just going for the nuts. Okay, so to con Freezer! To contradict what I said. Wait, where's the radar? L1? I, I am going to go into that spot because the Dragon Ball might be there. Yep, there it is. So. If Kriden goes to Raccoon, he will kill him because I'm pretty sure if you fight a, um, shall we say, groggy opponent and you beat them again, they lose two life points. So that might be handy to remember when we get to like level six and stuff. So for Kriden, I'm just gonna, um, actually, I might move Kriden out of the way just so Raccoon is forced to fight Goku. Because I want that interaction. Yes, come on, big boy. You can't see it, but I am vibing right now. Hey, you. You must know about the Dragon Balls. Tell me about them. Who are you? Are you in league with that Frieza guy? <coughs> You've got some nerve not calling him Master Frieza. Maybe I ought to reprimand you a bit. The Ginyu Force! Raccoon! I love that. I absolutely love that. <laughs> health level drops by half. Watch the health gauge. Okay, so I was wrong. Alright, cool. Good to know. Alright, so health is going to be halved. We're going to go for the Super Dragon Fist and just spam it. I'll take Raccoon down to one. I'm not sure which direction he's going to get knocked back in. But then we can go back and finish the job after we've gotten the Dragon Ball. So, Goku should rem- Oh! Goku should rem- Oh, wow. <laughs> so, Goku should remember this over area because, um... This is the Snowy Mountains where he fought... Oh god, which one was it? Was it white or silver from the Red Ribbon Army? I think it was white. It could have been silver. I don't know. He fights someone from the Red Ribbon Army here. So it's really cool that they did a callback to Dragon Ball. An area that I had no idea what this was when I played the original game. Okay, so he's over there, which is great. Um, we're going to get that Dragon Ball now. Alright, I remember not 
exactly knowing what the Dragon Balls did when you collected them all, but thinking, I think it's a good idea to do. I got some money. I think there's a second dialogue. I'm not sure. There we go. You moron! I just got careless, that's all. You better understand. You cannot defeat me. Don't go getting all happy and full of yourself. You just won by a fluke. All right, at this point, I'll just have to show you something I've been saving. <laughs> I don't save anything on my account. I'm coming for your head, boy. I always misremember Goku going Kaioken against Raccoon. I think because Raccoon and Nappa have similar body types. I always assume that Goku goes Kaioken. He doesn't. He just punches him once. It's not a fight. I do love this music, though. So, I think this stage... Oh, God. I think this stage has a second area, too. Ah, God. I just know he caught me with that. I can't remember which way it is. <laughs> you do well. You do well. What should I say? You die well. You die well. All right, we got Raccoon. What else we got? Serious. Freezer is sitting pretty right now. I'm going to. Oh yeah, Goku hasn't gone yet. I'm gonna get serious. That's two. That's two capsules. Hala mark. All right. Um, let's move Krillin over there. I want to fight Ginyu. Oh no, the money! I don't know why, I really like that sound. Alright, let's have this conversation going on. Ginyu sounded a little froggy, didn't he, earlier? So, you're the Saiyan who has turned against Master Frieza. And you must be that Ginyu guy who's friends with Frieza. That's Captain Ginyu! You'll pay for making foods of us. I'm going to teach you a lesson. You must be the Saiyan who turned against Master Frieza. Frieza? I hardly even know her. <laughs> anyway, I do like how they've translated the, the, the material. So like that Ginyu guy and that Frieza guy. Wow. Not obviously disrespectful in English is clearly a little bit of like, um, what's the word? Just a disregard for honorifics and respect and titles and stuff. I think it's here. Whoa. There we go. Oh, so it's an avalanche. Wait, did I lose health because of that? <laughs> I hope not. Oh, I did. Oh, crap. Worth it. Uh oh. Right in your face. Uh oh. <gasps> oh, no. Okay, we're good. What button am I gonna press? There you go. So that's what happens when the Zanku Fist is successful. You basically paralyze your opponent. Boom. What's worse? No, I'm not gonna do it. But it would be funny if Krillin killed Ginyu. I might... 
Oh, nothing. Oh, damn. Okay. Oh, can you want some more? Huh? Oh, that, that's, that is very cute. Okay. I see. This guy is better than I thought. Sorry to ruin your grand entrance, but I'm going to have to take you out again. You're certainly sure of yourself. Yeah. No one's ever spoken to me. Hey, like yo. Before. These eyes are bulging. <laughs> I don't know what in the cocaine he's had, but my god. Alright, I think um, he's getting a bit too mad for his own good. Let's, let's put him down. I'm gonna put him down. Critten, prepare the frog. Oh, I can hear this song all day. All day. Oh my god. Alright, which button is he gonna press? Oh, damn. See, I don't mind that as a rock, paper, scissors chance uh, encounter. Because it's just one and done. Whereas when it comes to, like, Dragon Rush in Budokai 3, that's really not fun. Because it's, like, three entire sections. And then the AI, instead of getting good, the AI just spams that technique over and over again which means I have to play very shamelessly oh my god I'm trying to transform here have some respect for the Kaioken I've had enough of you damn I missed I missed the stationary enemy. I don't even know how you do that. Alright, it's time to finish him. <gasps> Freezer! Damn, I really wanted that. I'm gonna have... Goku kill Ginyu. Because he's the main character. Damn, there's no dialogue. I'm not going to have him kill Goku just for the sake of getting Krillin to chat to him, but I am sure that Krillin and Frieza will have a chat. But then again, Krillin didn't chat to Raccoon, he just said he might not live. I don't have time for that, like, second-rate way of thinking. But Krillin will fight Frieza. I'll give him the first crack. And um, as you might have noticed, there are no um, first-form models for freezer or cell they come in final and perfect form respectively no first form no second form no third form no uh um imperfect semi-perfect none of that i do think that means no 100 percent or super perfect damn Alright. While it's annoying, I kind of get why um, Berta, Jace, and Goldo aren't in the games because, like, what would they do? I don't think there's a fun way to include them in these games. Whoop. All right, Ginyu is no longer a problem. You're a welcome universe. Thank you. If I was Goku, I would charge the entire Earth 10 million zeni. This superhero stuff is expensive. You gotta pay me. Zanku Fist. Uh, thank you very much. I already had that move. Krillin is just here for moral support. Speaking of. Let's go. Yeah, Krillin needs a bit of a boost. Oh god, oh god, Freeze is gonna take the money. What's Freeze gonna do with the money? Freeze has no need for money. Alright, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna go um, pincer style. Ah, oh, damn it! <laughs> Five 
500! I hate that. Critten will get first crack. I don't think there's anything else under here. Nah. <gasps> Frieza doesn't want it! You coward! Oh, you're a waste man. You're, you're actually a coward. And I hate you for that. Oh, is he going for extra life? Because if he does that, we're going to have a problem. Oh, crap. Oh, um, is he going away? Oh, no. Have I messed around too much? <laughs> Alright, let's get this guy out of here, huh? We're going to go for the double... Turtle pincer attack. Shit, he's running out. He's getting out of here. He's getting out of dodge. Come here, Freezer. You can't escape us forever. Yeah, you know who you want. You know what it's about. Alright, Criden, you go to Dende. Because you may not live. Goku, dig, because Freezer's coming for you. Let's not waste a turn, huh? All right, what have we got? What have we got? Saiyan Spirit. God is disabled. Oh my god. I don't like that. <laughs> Interessante. All right, all right. I guess it is me who has to go to Freezer. My god, he's so... Stush. With his lipstick. So you're Frieza, huh? You're a lot more puny than I thought. I see. And you're a lot stronger than I thought. I'm a little bit surprised that there's someone in the world stronger than Captain Ginyu. But you are still no match for me. Maybe. But we don't know that yet. Exactly. That's a lot of nerve. <laughs> I do love all Goku Freezer interactions in games just because they're the complete antithesis of each other and you can just feel that even here Goku's like yeah you never know and Freezer's just being like hey this is the way life is this is the order the natural order and to think Freezer's not trained a day in his life I don't think that's necessarily true but Super is Super Super Oh no! I do love that Freezer teleports instead of dodging. Like the the act of movement is too too much for him. Oh my god! Oh, he got me there. Wake up, Frieza. It's all over. Okay, I was worried there for a second. Um, nothing to worry about. Goku's here to save the day. Yeah, done though. Um, and I'm gonna keep free. <laughs> He's running away. I'm gonna keep Freezer as far away from his spaceship as possible so he can't run. Um, so Kriden, you go after Freezer, cause we gonna get this. We gonna get this work. If you try to run away, we will chase you. Understand? Hey yo! Oh no! <laughs> I didn't think that would happen. This doesn't look very good. Um, you know what? Critten could get the last crack. Because it's clear that their conversation has been exhausted. Freezer doesn't want to talk to Man again. What I really like about Budokai 2 is how it just goes above Budokai 1, which did a very good job of telling the story up to the Cell Saga. And then Budokai 2 
um, has all the characters in Z, more or less. All the important ones, all the good ones. Oh my god. And then, oh my god, I missed it. And then, um, Budokai 3 has movie characters and GT characters on top of everyone in Z, so I really like that. But my favorite thing about Budokai 2 is all the what ifs. So, if you're um, Super Boo, oh god. <laughs> no chance. So if you're um, Super Boot, you can absorb Vegeta, you can absorb Tien and Yamcha, you can absorb um, Frieza, you can absorb Cell. It's really cool. And Tien and Yamcha do the fusion dance in this game. It is hilarious. Um, you can use the Wolfgang Volleyball Fist. And um, uh, Goku and Hercule can fuse as well. And there are two models. That is amazing. And hopefully I get to show you some of that. But um, Krillin's going to get that last crack for revenge, for being mounted. That a boy, Krillin. That a boy. Always, always good to go into a fight with confidence, right? Can you imagine a UFC fighter going, I may not live. <laughs> like, what? Ain't people buying the tickets for that? Well, I might not like Jake Paul, at least, you know, he goes into fights with a little bit of arrogance. A little bit of something. Come on, Krillin. We're going to make Krillin great. I'd say again, but I'd be lying. Oh, no. That's just unfair, isn't it? But, I mean, it did do a lot of damage. Yeah. You think you can teleport? I can read you. Just have to look out for the smell of perfume. Once I get destructive disc, it's over for you. Luckily, I can't hit Freezer and make an avalanche here. Damn. You can teleport where you like. I'll read you forever. I will follow you. Damn. That death wave is serious. That death wave is serious. Oh, yo. All right, I am messing around. Let me get serious. <laughs> I said, let me get serious and air a death beam. Crazy. All right, bye, Frieza. Valiant Fist. Ugh, I can't believe I... Freezer was attacked. Wait. <laughs> Give me the chance to read your script, bro. Um, the Ginyu Force uh, dead. Wait, what? I thought I killed them. Oh, my lord. Hey, we unlock snowy mountains. Let's go. All right, level three now. Hey, this is quite happy. Oh, we're a Namek. Tee hee. <laughs> Fire. 
Frieza! Do, 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 do. <laughs> Fully recovered from that ass whipping. Hey, yo. Because Frieza knows what he wants. T. <laughs> the principal saying T. Bada. Defeat Frieza. I want that Super Saiyan now. Okay, one ally. All right, so it's Namek. I am assuming this is where Frieza is going to meet his end. So do I want Krillin or Piccolo? We are going with Piccolo because we had Krillin on the last level. And Piccolo and Krillin are the ones that obviously make the most sense here. Ba -da -ba -ba -ba. Piccolo. Hey. The Sonic Shadow and Knuckles of the Dragon Ball world. Let's get that capsule. I think uh, Goku and Vegeta are about to fight. Look how the um, the armor is on the no guarding square. That makes no sense. Or cruel sense of irony. Piccolo, get that radar. I need that Dragon Ball. Okay. It looks like we know where the Dragon Ball is. Oh, those two are still alive, huh? Uh-oh. Duel of Fate. Kakarot, it's you! This is perfect! Before I defeat Frieza, I will dispose of you! Vegeta, this isn't the time for us to be fighting! If we don't get rid of this Frieza guy, it's <laughs> going to get awful! Look at them doing the same pose. Grumble all you want, but do it after you fought me! Hey, that guitar at the beginning? Hey, yay! Someone was cooking! So, um... Budokai 2 was the first Dragon Ball game that I played, which made me realize, oh, these games can be good? Because my first Dragon Ball game was a game called Final Bout on PS1 and not only was it out of sync because it had a bunch of GT characters when I mean in 96 we barely even got Dragon Ball Z um, but the game was so bad even as like a six seven year old I could tell that this game sucked <laughs> it was absolutely terrible so I'm really happy for a game like this. They've done really well. I have noticed that Vegeta's icon has his Boo Saga look. I mean, they couldn't be bothered to make another render. And Vegeta is in his uh, Cell Saga armor. I do like that armor though, I won't even lie. So Piccolo, where's that Dragon Ball? Gotta find that Dragon Ball. Look out for them all. Okay, we're at it. Um, I would like to dig. Oh, there's nothing? Uh-oh, here come the Ginyu Force. Oh, no. Raccoon's going to be 10% stronger than last time. Yeah, I know you want this Vegeta. I'll give you another beating. Have you decided to fight me seriously yet, Kakarot? Yeah, it looks like I really will have to settle things with you first. 
I feel that's code for Kaioken. Yeah, once again, if you are enjoying the content, please drop a like, leave a comment, let us know what other PS2 games you'd like to see on the channel. Uh, I am going through a collection, so all the games I played through my childhood, I kind of have already. I'm gonna break this guy's face. I wonder if I can knock him into other islands. How unfortunate. If only you knew the Kaioken Vegeta, you could be um, so much stronger. You might almost be as strong as me. Oh, whoa. Drop dead. Ah, uh, down to yellow. Oh, crap. I had to sort that out real quick. Oh. Bye bye, Prince. Don't come back. Piccolo, why don't you treat yourself to an extra life? Oh shit! <laughs> oh no! Piccolo, you were meant to get the Dragon Ball! Goku, you stay where you are. Oh god. I messed up big time there. Yeah, stay where you are. Oh, Vegeta. I thought you were going to chill still. This doesn't look very good. Because I, I wanted Vegeta and Piccolo to fight. But it's a shame we'll never get that. Alright, let's just wrap this up real quick. Because uh, this guy is jarring me. I believe... I believe um, after this is Cell, and then after that, like, even in the Cell Saga, it's rough. Dr. Jero, uh, 18. I don't think 17's in this game. Whoa. You know, fair enough. Good, good. I'm gonna hit this move so often against Kid Boo, it's not even funny. All right, either join me or die at this point. I don't have time to fight you again. I'm busy. Hey, we unlocked Vegeta. You know what? 10 out of 10. What else we got? Nose dive crash. Okay. What, more? Gallic gun. Let's go. Just this once, I'm going to help you out. Otherwise, I'm afraid we won't be freezer. <laughs> but don't you forget, someday I will settle the score between us. Yeah, I gotcha. Ah, I don't know what that's about, but um, cool. Piccolo, go back to where the Dragon Ball is. Goku, go over there. Now, Vegeta, will you give Goku a boost if you stand next to each other? Let's see. All right. Team Gogeta, go. 
Uh oh. Is that Vegeta is fighting? The Ginyu Force. So the captain himself is stepping up hard. Where are the rest of you? The others are headed to another planet. Rikuma will be more than enough to handle you. There. So it's a shame we won't be able to perform our special fighting pose. Ah, no matter. I could use the exercise. I'm gonna thoroughly teach you a lesson. Oh no. We're going to do this, and let's get started. Just realized I didn't give Vegeta any moves. Shit. This will truly be my toughest <laughs> challenge. I need to remember to give Vegeta his three moves after this. Ooh, I like this music though. Drop dead. Damn. Vegeta's limbs are shorter than Goku, so I have to fight a little bit differently. Damn. Damn. Let's make this quick, huh? I mean, light work. Even without any moves. God. Damn. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Are they going to have some morale? Boost? No. Freezer don't want none, so Piccolo. First things first. Let's get that Dragon Ball, huh? Hey, it's the four star. Oh, yeah, before I forget. Got it gun, nose dive crash, and wasn't there another one? Oh no, Vegeta was the thing. Alright, um. What's Saiyan Spirit again? Guard is disabled. Yeah, let's put that on. And then just give him serious as well. Because Vegeta is going down here. I don't even know which one of them I'm gonna fight. Is it Raccoon? <laughs> Raccoon, huh? Ginyu Force! Raccoon! Huh? <laughs> you know, I would say the same thing. <laughs> I bet he did that stupid pose again, too. So, Raccoon said that he had some um, special move back at na uh, in the snowy mountains. I don't know. Maybe it was just showing me his ass or something. Like, I don't even know what he did. He didn't achieve anything. I'm going to fry this guy with my Gallic gun. Hmm. Real quick. You do well. <laughs> you do well. Love that. This game has brought a lot of funny quotes to my childhood, me and my brother. You do well, and the, uh, how rude. Yeah, F your gun, bro. Yep, yeah, easy. Mm. Because Vegeta has a pro control on him, it is easy, light work. We all know what happened when Vegeta fought Raccoon, but fell. it didn't go well. That was quite an attack, Vegeta. To think that you could beat me even once. How about it? Would you care to join the Ginyu Force? Come on, if you join us. I'll think up a special fighting pose for the six of us! <gasps> Never! How would you ever expect me to perform such a ridiculous pose? I see. In that case, I have no choice. You'll just have to die, Vegeta! 
Damn, that's sad. What I do appreciate is Vegeta looks like he was thinking about it a little bit. He was thinking about what pose he could be pulling off. You know, I think Vegeta could make a great Captain Ginyu, to be honest. I think he'd be a great addition to the Ginyu Force. The Vegeta Force. Ooh, I like the sound of that, actually. Hmm. If only we could change the characters' minds. <laughs> I actually think there might be some dialogue that reflects that, but I don't know if I want to lose to get that. <laughs> I might lose so I can talk to Ginyu again, because I can't remember. Oh, this might take a while. I don't think there's anything special from Goku and Raccoon talking to each other. I don't think there's anything special from Goku talking to Ginyu. But I think this happens the third time these two talk, so yeah, we can chance it. Oh wait, I might be misremembering, I don't know. Oh, this is going to take a while. I'm hoping I thought this through properly. Alright, we got, he got there in the end, huh? Damn, three people in one space, that's crazy. Um... Let's <laughs> everyone's confused. Alright, Piccolo's there. Let's have Goku fight Raccoon. You again? You realize that on Earth I already beat you, right? I'm not gonna take it anymore. I, Rikum of the Ginyu Force, am not going to be made a fool of. I think if I beat Rikum here, he just dies. I need that. We need that. Yeah, I'm just gonna kill him now. the gun I'll blast you all right let's get this bum out of here huh let's fight some real fighters freezer was actually kind of a challenge or was he I don't think he was actually yeah see showed you off that mechanic I think I've got Raccoon unlocked already so this is uh it's all right we can wish him back with our Dragon Balls it's fine hey what Why why did he get stronger that his friend died? Would you mind not getting in my way anymore? He asked nicely. For no reason. <laughs> why are you laughing? Because you're so strong. 
Because you have so much more power than I do! <laughs> if you don't watch the anime, that is just such a weird line. He just comes off like a masochist, like he gets that a like he gets off from getting that ass beat, you know? It's kinda weird. Hey but you know, Goku can also be a genie, he wishes my command. And you can see Guru's house not Guru, the Grand Elder's house back there. So I'm gonna move Goku away so Vegeta um, talks to uh, Ginyu again. How did you miss? He's right in front of you. Alright, so Goku, you move down here. Piccolo, I think you get a morale beast, right? Let's go. Come on. Now, Vegeta, finish the job. Oh my god, you only have one life point. I'm gonna have to go heal you. I took the trouble to make sure you wouldn't die from that, Vegeta. I am kind after all. However, I'm running out of time, and so are you. Goodbye, Vegeta! Darn it! I must beat this guy! They're having a, a lot of uh, dialogue together. I don't know. I don't know what's going on there. Okay, let's go. Damn! Unfortunately, I can't allow Vegeta to die because he's on his own. He's on his um, <laughs> only life left. Oh my God. Goodbye, Ginyu. The evil you have done is enough. Oh. Have we got Ginyu? Yeah, let's go. Training vest. That's kind of spooky. Alright, so we can just mess around now. Alright, Vegeta is going to heal up. I think it might be a good idea for Goku to heal up too. Piccolo is going to go straight for the Juggalot. Oh, here we go. Where is that carpet going to take us? I am curious. Looks like it's going to be Piccolo and Vegeta, uh, Piccolo and Freezer. I'm going to see if I can get each of them to have a go. Oh crap. <laughs> Vegeta and Piccolo, you can dig. We got some money. Hey, that's nice. That's what we like to see. Big money, five hundred. Oh, we have interest. Interesting things to say. Nope. Okay. Well, that was a mistake. You got moves right, Piccolo. Right? Yeah, you do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I just want that special beam cannon. Maybe I have to buy it. 
Ooh, a Frieza theme. Hey, where's Nao? Damn. I think these long limbs might actually <laughs> might actually work in Frieza's favor. Damn. Damn. Frieza's just got on me got me on what? Got me on strings! Apologies for the lack of uh, speaking. Um, it's actually got a bit hairy for a second. I'm sure, I'm gonna beat Freezer, but I had to focus for a little bit. I've got the, you know. Oh no! <laughs> but what a perfect way to end that fight. If that diff wave here, I might have died. Okay, let's move Piccolo out of here. We shall move Goku over there. And Vegeta, you can heal. He couldn't resist. You again? Don't tell me. You're a Saiyan too? Yeah, I'm a Saiyan from Earth. I see. I once killed a Saiyan on planet Vegeta that looked like you. You're his son, huh? How fun. You'll get to share his fate. For the sake of all the people you've killed, I'm going to beat you! That's quite interesting that they're using such violent language as kill. Because typically they, they don't use such language in the anime, but maybe there's different rules for TVs versus games. But this is cool. And I didn't catch that originally playing. I, I obviously wouldn't have. But yeah, the Bardock reference. The reference to... Jace at Berta and Gordo not being in the game. I really like that. They didn't have to, but I, I do appreciate that. Whoa. Hey, okay. Damn. Woo. Damn. That's my fault. What am I doing? Rip him up. Woof. Yeah, Freezer. This is what he's looking like. This is what he's looking like for you. Damn. Get him up in that combo. Damn, misjudged again. Oh no! Damn! Oh god, I gotta predict. Oh god. Yeah! Get out of here. Alright, so Goku's gonna move to here. Vegeta. I think two lives should be enough, no? But just in case, we're gonna get him healed another time. That should be enough. Um, Piccolo has nothing interesting to say, so you can dig. Oh no! Freeze is coming for your boy. Um, 
Let's get Vegeta up there. And then Goku can go up here. Oh, actually, get that capsule. Um, yeah, you can go down here. So no matter what, he should be cornered. <gasps> oh. He really does have a hate boner for the prince. Something about that is just taking me back. Shout out Linda Young. What an amazing voice actor. Shout out Chris Sabat. Like, almost a one man show. Does Vegeta, Piccolo, Yamcha. I want to say Oolong. That might not be right. Sorry, I am going into that mode again where I'm not even talking. <laughs> I do like this fight in the enemy. But, um. Damn! He's, he's kind of reading me. I can't slow down for a single second. That was a bad choice. Oh lord. Alright. That was way too close for comfort. Oh my goodness. What have we got? Chi Chi's wish. I'm not entirely sure what that is. But okay. Where will you go, Frieza? Oh. I'm gonna make him come to me because I don't want to fight him on that square at all. Yes, that's Chi Chi's wish right there. Get your money, son. Alright, I think he's only concerned with one Saiyan, so I think we can uh, safely return. Alright, let's end it with your one life point. I want Super Saiyan for Goku now. That was a close one just now. How can you have that kind of power? <laughs> you miserable Saiyan! I don't get it! I barely even touched him! That actually hurts. It hurts! Love that they were putting the same pose at the beginning of that conversation. <laughs> it's funny, like, they're continuing the conversation. Like, everything else that's happened in between doesn't matter. Yeah, but it is what it is. I think this game assumes that I'm going to just do all the major fights as Goku. So I don't want to disappoint. Kaioken. Damn. 
Eh, Frieza is not easy. He's not easy. Alright, let's try. Oh, whoa. Bam. Um, I don't have a spirit bomb. I keep pressing back as if that's block. Damn. Damn. It's now. No, I now or never. What a way to end it. The Freezer Saga ended by a Kamehameha. <laughs> Freezer. Very happy about that. I was been knocked to Loopy. Darn it! Darn it all! I won. If it comes to me being killed by you, then I'd rather die by my own hand. But I am not going to die. You are the ones who will. I'm going to destroy this planet. Okay. Yikes! If I don't get out of here soon, the whole planet's going to explode. What about Vegeta and Piccolo? This spaceship, I'll escape from Planet Namek. Okay. <laughs> I do appreciate that. And we got Planet Namek too. Let's go. That is a great place to end this, actually. Well, I think the next level is going to start. Phew, we barely made it. <laughs> I finally found you, Goku. Who? Who are you? Hmm. I am Dr. Zero, the scientist of the Red Ribbon Army, which you destroyed. Red Ribbon Army? That's right. Thanks to you, the Red Ribbon's dream of world domination was wiped out, and only I remain. Since then, I continued my research as to how I could defeat you, Goku. And now, finally, my research is complete! Come! Uh, Cyberman! <laughs> I've selectively bred this sample to create my elite unit. Oh, no! Now go, my Cyber Rangers! Do away with Goku! Ba -da -ba -da -ba -da. Okay, multiple things. Cyber Rangers? <laughs> also, why are Cybermen gonna be the thing that kills Goku? Like, you don't remember what happened the first time Goku met the Cybermen? Crushed him. Easily. Anyway, this is a perfect place to end it. So, we've done an hour of Budokai 2 story mode. We've gotten through the first three stages. Frieza is dead. And... Now, we are about to fight Dr. Jiro, but find out what happens on stage four next time. Take care of yourselves and your loved ones. Stay safe. We'll see you on the next one. Remember to like, subscribe, and leave a comment. Cheers. Take care.